Welcome, Toxic Family, to another episode of The Devil and Me, and I couldn't be more excited to actually film this episode. Uh, we got another character back from the dead, and hopefully makes an appearance in this uh, episode as well, regrouping with the crew, and let's get the show on the road. Alright guys, this is where we left off, and if you're excited for this episode, make sure you smash the like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new, so uh, so you could keep in touch with for the next couple walkthroughs. How is all of this? He's got video feeds, recording things, and a mix of join up on the live streams as well. Mics. He's watching everything. It's more than that. He's got utilities running through here, hydraulics, electrics, everything. He can control the whole building from here. How far down does it go? This all connects. I'm guessing pretty far it's down. getting around the house. All right, here we go. We're playing as Kate. Yes. Investigate Charlie the control would say room. This guy is a fractured thing. That he's wearing a mask to put what he's doing on. Take a look at this. This is the FBI agent. We ran into him before. What is that? The guy we saw murdered. It was a setup? There was no groundskeeper. We saw a guy in a yellow jacket with our stuff. I guess that was Mr. Demet. Oh, that's I think true. It's a mistake to say he's just crazy. He is in full control of what he's doing. He's just not wired like the rest of us. That's not crazy. What is all this? He's been tracking us since we arrived. So North right now, last seen in the basement. South corridor, north corridor. Crazy so implies out of control. He thinks we're all what divided. Place? All right, this and he methodical. thinks Charlie That's is not dead. Crazy? No. So we have the upper hand here because he thinks we're all dead. Well, Wait, he thinks Charlie is dead. Is part of the performance. At best, maybe he's insecure Just... about something, and it gives him confidence. <laughs> Chicago Police, Mr. Monday, this is Chicago Police. Can you Mr. Monday? Mr. Monday, I'm Officer Stanley with Chicago Police Department. Can you hear me, sir? Agent Monday. Fuck. Fuck. Oh. Uh, dispatch, this is Officer Stanley. I, I need assistance at 8 West 50th Street requesting immediate backup. I'm in Agent Monday's apartment. There's, there's blood everywhere and, and a body. I need immediate support. I think... Whoa, that was a face. There's a face here. What is going on? So that was an officer he murdered. Okay, we're getting a little bit more backstory. That parenting can definitely be a factor. Oh, we got some stairs here. Could be a shitty dad just as much, or an uncle. Hey, so we finish figure, investigating. Really? Do we go up or down? Okay, I guess we go come up. This is pretty creepy that he was following us this, like this all up throughout the the hotel. What is this? Oh, those are the walls. Over here. He controlled the walls through here. Through here. Look at this. Let me get my. It saw his little tricks of moving walls and crap. Nothing in this shit box is real. He controls everything from here. It's a murder factory. You're right. We should use this against him. I want to find Mark, not play Demet's game. If we trap him, we can look for Mark without looking over our shoulders the whole time. Okay, look. He's in here, right? So we get him to go down this hall and we trap him between these two moving walls. There's no other way out of there. He'd be stuck. Okay. But how do you make sure he goes down that hall to begin with? One of us is going to have to be bait. Oh no. No, no way. It's too risky, Jamie. So is letting him run free. I'd say that's more dangerous. Come on. There's no second chances here. It's my plan. I'll be the bait. If you're sure, just... If it looks like it's going south, get the hell out of there. No argument here. Confident, uh, you should take it. You could use that as a weapon if need be. I'm gonna hang on to it. I'm more likely to need it. Okay, that's enough of a moment. Let's do this. Stick to the plan. 
Obviously. Stick to the plan. So how do we get out? Third floor must be a work in progress. Okay, be ready. But y'all don't even We're know how to, to control. Have to right to trap him and not me. All right. Here goes nothing. <sighs> oh my. Oh, we're in the room with the creeper. Let me know if you guys are as creeped out as I am with this plan. I don't think it's a very good plan, but I mean, they want to they want to go with it, they go with it. I mean, he he has to have a way out. This is the thing he built. Head down the hall. Keep to the right. Uh, I have a bad feeling he's just gonna creep up on us here. Was this on the mat? Okay, we're good. Oh my. I'm holding my breath. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just do not feel very comfortable with this. Do I have to shimmy past something here? Probably right here. Yep. Oh my. He's gonna be right here. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, don't like that one bit. <laughs> it's the sound effects. I have the headphones. And I have them on full blast. So More rooms being built. Any sound effect. Huh. That's super loud is gonna get me. I saw something shiny on the floor. More coins. Yee. Oh, this one's gold. How much was that? Ooh, another 10 coins. Not bad, not bad. So, Mr. Wannabe Homes here is building another... Another room? Is it? Oh my god. Stop with the jump scares. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are probably gonna really enjoy this episode and I am not enjoying it at all So he's here in this room Can't believe we're going straight after him like this is not a great idea Here we go we're gonna have to start running. Shit. Run! Damn it, bitch. Oh man, here we go, here we go. Run, Jamie! Okay, we got the quick quick time events. We got this, we got this. Damn! Uh, run. He apparently walks pretty fast, so just keep running. <sighs> that would happen. Cake, hang on, please. Do it. We did it! It actually worked out! He's gonna punch through it or something. Nah, he's right there. No! <gasps> How did he get through? Or is that another one? Jamie, fucking run! Oh no, this ain't good. This ain't good. Oh god. Push him. Fuck. He wants us to keep running. This is very <laughs> odd. Oh, man. 
He's gonna trap us. No! We're dead. Jamie! Oh no. Shit! What is it? A button. There's a reverse symbol on it. What, what, what does it? Oh, no. hell no. Make me choose. I'm not playing this game. Fuck this. I'm not playing this game. I can't do this. I won't kill you. No, I don't want to see this. I'm sorry. No, okay. You have the screwdriver. Open the thing up. Open it. Oh, please. I don't want to die. How the fuck could you do this? Fuck you, Jamie! Oh. No, Kate. Jamie, I don't want to die. No, like this. No, not like this. Please! an excruciating way to go. Jamie pressed the button to kill Kate. I know they didn't always see eye to eye, but I didn't think she'd be that cold-blooded. It's a catchy tune, isn't it? Erin's Don't Be Scared song. Sadly, it didn't work. Meanwhile, Charlie has proved himself capable, surviving the furnace and every other obstacle. Who would have thought it? Did the hint I gave you earlier help? No. Perhaps you'd like another. I'll take it, but I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get it. Let's see if Sir Arthur can help us. This is from The Man with the Twisted Lip. Have you read it? should. A trusty comrade is always of use, and a chronicler still more so. I think that last bit might refer to me. You should get back. I hope these chats are helpful. I certainly wouldn't want them to be intimidating. I'll be watching your progress. As always, watching very closely. Alright guys, that's gonna do it for this episode and I'm actually super sad we lost another character. I wanted to make everybody survive, but I mean it is what it is and just make sure you smash the like button, subscribe if you're new and like always guys, stay toxic. Laters.